What are you in No Man's Sky? And is there blood in the game? And more about the multi-tool here on Cobra TV. Thank you guys for coming back to Cobra TV. This is going to be kind of a mixed up episode and it's going to be kind of talking about some of the questions that I've seen in the comment section quite a bit. And I've seen some misleading videos about character customization and what your character is and yada yada. Plus, you heard me write uh, Blood and No Man's Sky for the uh, alien animals. And as far as the multi-tool, I keep hearing people say, uh, well, there's only one type of gun. That's boring. And I keep reading people asking if there's more than one multi-tool. But first, let's talk about character customization and what you are. Let's get the obvious out of the way. We don't know what we are. But I've seen some people asking if we were procedurally generated as a character, who you are is procedurally generated. I've also seen some videos orbiting around here and there that, that claim that we are all procedural. But instead of wondering, let's take a look at some of the known facts on that subject. Do I think that our character is procedurally generated and different from everybody else's? I'm going to say no to that uh, based on the facts that we've gotten from Sean Murray and Hello Games. And the biggest thing about that that was said is that you will know, we will all know what we look like when we find another player. When we run across another player, we will be able to know what we look like. Now, seeing how there's no in-game chat, although they did tease Game Informer of a possibility of something like that may be happening, but as of now, there's no in-game chat. There's no gamer tag above <laughs> your your character. So if you met another player, if you ran, a, if you were lucky enough to finally run across another player, there's no way that player can say it can describe to you what you look like. So therefore, seeing that other player, without having him tell you what you look like. And Sean Murray says, you'll know what you look like when you see another player. Then you're not procedurally generated. The download for No Man's Sky is going to be a really small download. And the fact that it did get a, as big as it did is due to things in the game that are not procedurally generated. As in the Sentinels and certain type of music that are going to play for everybody and yourself. Now this could always change when they finally release the game or it could be something that's also hidden from us. But based on what he said, you'll know what you look like when you see another player. Kind of tells me that we're all going to look very much alike. Now, if there's something on the inside of that suit that other players can see, I don't know. That information has not been stated. Now, as far as character customization, he was asked during the 70 questions interview if you could customize your character. Can you customize the look of your character? The... Sort of. And I'm pretty sure that the reason why you can kind of uh, have a character customization is because is due to your upgrade choices. So even if you do come across another player, your upgrade choices might alter your suit in a different way than his upgrade choices did. So there might be a slight difference in appearance, but for the most part, as of now, it looks like it's going to be pretty much close to the same. Hello Games is also not telling us who we are or what we are, what race we are, if we're male or for female. Can you select a gender at the beginning of the game? Uh, no, no, we haven't said who you are. And there's two reasons for that. One, they have a lore for us, a reason why we're in the game and doing what we're doing. And number two, it's so that you could be whoever you wanna be. You could let your imagination run wild and let your own true story unfold. Now, before we get to the blood in No Man's Sky, Oh, that sounds so weird to say, but but before we get to that, let's go ahead and talk about the multi-tool. A lot of people are questioning if there is more than one multi-tool slash gun, and a lot of people are, are asking if there is more than one. And the, the answer to that is yes. You can find a different multi-tool. Um, it's going to have different technologies, uh, different... Uh, it's going to be able to do different things, and it's going to look different, as Sean says here. For you know, we even showed weapons yeah. um, on the ground. Those are procedural too. Tell me about combat. You know, you have that sort of guns, or I don't know what's called a yeah, it's transponder. Like a, it's device. like a multi-tool, basically, a multi -tool, because you yeah. use it for, like I'll show you, use it for mining. Yeah, uh, it's actually how you scan as well. Is through okay. that, yeah. um, and you use it for combat. Okay, right, and you can upgrade that. Um, but you can also find 
new ones. Right. New ones have different abilities, different technologies that will be installed. And according to Danny O'Dwyer, who was given a chance to play the game, he talks about the multi-tools too, and it almost sounds like you can craft it, but I don't know if you could actually craft it or if they're just upgrades that you could do to the multi-tool. But take a look at what he says here. Yeah, so they've, I think they've been kind of like intentionally obfuscating exactly what the narrative is because in the same way that like they're not saying like, oh, you can make this many guns. Actually, you can make probably millions mm -hmm. because of all the different components you can do. But we'll so that is very interesting. And we have seen, I believe, three different multi-tools so far. The one that we're all used to in the older trailers and two from the I've Seen Things trailer. So the answer to that question is yes, there's going to be tons of multi-tools. So I've also seen a lot of questions about the rating for No Man's Sky. Is it going to be E for everyone? Is it going to be M for Mature? Um, I have no idea. But what's really interesting is that there is going to be blood in the game. And although Jeff here was kidding, Sean wasn't. He was being very serious. Take a look. I will. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What is the kill animation for a creature? Is it just lying there dead? Is there blood? Well, there, uh, there can be different types of blood. Yeah. Um, <laughs> procedural blood. Procedural blood. They have procedural ragdolls and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah. Be very sad to see my little. <laughs> so that is very, very exciting. Something that we have not seen yet at all in the trailers, which, you know, just makes you realize, man, we've seen a lot of gameplay come from Hello Games, and not one drop of blood. So, if that's something that's in the game and they have it turned off. Just think about how many other things are turned off when they're showing this game. I think one of the most exciting things for me when I finally get to play No Man's Sky, it's not going to be the planets, it's not going to be the space battles, it's not going to be uh, the space stations or the sentinels. One of the exciting things for me is going to be able to finally see all of the things that they were hiding. No matter how petty they are, probably the biggest thing I'm most excited for when the game finally gets released is seeing the game through the eyes and minds of all of you. I cannot wait to see everybody's gameplay when it gets uploaded. I will also be putting gameplay of No Man's Sky on the channel. And one of the things that I really wanna do is spotlight some of your discoveries or some of your moments. So if you have that, really cool moment that you want to send in maybe i can do an entire show once a week or once a month where i showcase awesome gameplay awesome discoveries or just just pure awesome moments from you guys let me know what you guys think in the comment section below your subcasts from the two weeks prior are going to be uploaded i promise i had such an amazing time talking to you guys and i cannot wait to do it again just hang in there guys i will get them up as always i love you guys and i will see you in the next video until next time.